so here's the deal. I said, I'm going to pay 100 pounds, which is like $7. Bring me everything that's good. And uh, they agreed, so let's see what happens. I hate to leave food over, but I tried my very best, and uh, I apologize to all the kids in Africa who could have used this food. Good morning from downtown Iskandaria. So it's about 8 a.m., and man, I got to my hotel around 9, and I just slept for about 10 hours, and it was glorious. That's not glorious, but we're going to get some breakfast here at the world-famous, or the Egyptian famous Mohammed Ahmed which is right down the street so let's get some local food some local grub and uh, map out our day one noticeable difference between Cairo and Alexandria is uh, the city doesn't hustle and bustle here as early as it does in Cairo once it hits 6 in the morning you hear the beep 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 everywhere in Cairo but here on the streets of Alexandria it's 8 a.m. we're on the coast of the Mediterranean and people have a Mediterranean attitude about things, it seems. So I think we're on the right way. We'll ask these people here. And uh, let's see. Mohammed Ahmed? Mohammed Ahmed. This way, okay, shukran, shukran. Two three. Okay, okay, shukran. So we are on the right way. The most famous restaurant in Alexandria, in Iskandaria, is this way. Go figure. So it's a scene out of a movie. And the streets are littered with garbage. But, okay. They've been doing this for a long, long time. Alright, so I turned on Google Maps and, uh... Yeah, this isn't it. I think people were leading me down random alleyways to uh, probably, I don't know what the fuck, I don't know. I have no idea why people are doing that. Oh, whoa, there's a fucking pigeon. So I think we're on the right track here. Let's see. Okay, we're back on a main thoroughfare here. And this is downtown Alexandria. Downtown Iskandaria. Salam alaikum. Sadiki. And, uh, yeah, if, if, you know, there's any sort of skepticism as to, you know, is this a main street or not, we are literally in downtown Alexandria and it's this quiet at 8 in the morning okay so after going nearly a mile in the wrong direction we are semi close to the famous Mohammed Ahmed and it's as if the locals have some sort of vested interest in directing you to another restaurant they like lead you down this shitty alley and then at the end of the alley there's like a half decent looking restaurant and you know I think psychologically they want you to settle for it but we don't settle on this channel. We go for the famous Muhammad Ahmed. Google says I've arrived. I'm not sure, there's one and two. I don't know which one is Muhammad Ahmed. Maybe I'll ask these people over here. Neither of these are Muhammad Ahmed. Muhammad Ahmed is uh, apparently this McDonald's here or around the corner from the McDonald's. I think this is Muhammad Ahmed. Could be wrong. Ooh, Muhammad Salah. The king of Egypt. Salam alaikum. Muhammad Ahmed? Oh, over there. Here, Chai, yeah? Chai. Okay, I come back. Yeah? Okay, shukran, shukran. Yeah, that is, uh, that is not Muhammad Ahmed. God damn, this is becoming difficult. Salam alaikum. Muhammad Ahmed? Muhammad Ahmed here. Here, here. Oh, shukran. This is it. This is Muhammad Ahmed. Wow. 
So next door is the uh, express version. This is the actual restaurant, Muhammad Ahmed. Maybe that's Muhammad Ahmed over there. And uh, yeah, let's order some food. Okay, so here's the deal. I said, I'm going to pay 100 pounds, which is like $7. Bring me everything that's good. And uh, they agreed, so let's see what happens. Part one of the dining extravaganza here is uh, the bread. And you can tell it's fluffy and nice. It's bread. It's not bad. It's pretty good. I have seen what 100 pounds can buy in Egypt. It's about seven dollars. And um, yeah, if I don't get food for like three people here, then they're ripping me off. But at the same time, if they have the common sense to just give me good food for uh, you know me overpaying. Let's just see what happens. I'm, I'm curious to see what happens. Welcome, see you. And this is what's happening. Okay. Tamam, tamam. So it looks like we have some fish and some omelet and some beans and some falafel. Tahina, tahina. Oh, okay. Okay. Green salad. Shukran, shukran, shukran. So for seven dollars, this is what's happening. It's a piece. So why don't we dig in one by one, and I will give you my taste test. These beans, they have these vegetables and this cream. I think it's either hummus or tahini or something. Oh, shit. Nine point two out of ten. It's fucking good. The beans, so good. Next, we move to the fish. This is Alexandria, after all, Port City. If I can actually cut it. All right, let's move to the omelet here, because I think I can cut it. Okay, a solid 8.4 out of 10, it's great. It's burnt, you can tell. You can taste like the char from the grill, which is not really my taste, but the people that like it will like it. The falafel is like crispy. Super crispy, super airy, I mean, super fluffy. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Shukran, shukran. The falafel, this is literally the best falafel I've ever had in my life. It's like soft, like a pillow. Mm, the hummus, so good. The fish here. Squeeze some lime. I'm just gonna be a pig. Mm. Mm. It's decent. Solid fish. Solid fish. French fries. The French fries. So here we go. Seven dollars. Alexandria, Egypt. I paid three times as much as everyone else, but hey, they brought the show. Mm, they brought the show. I hate to leave food over, but. I tried my very best and uh, I apologize to all the kids in Africa who could have used this food. But it is what it is, right? I said, um, enough food for three people and yeah, they delivered. This was enough food for three people. So yeah, 100 pounds, $7.50 in Egypt, Alexandria. Don't pay more than 30 pounds for your food, please. $2 is enough. So don't let anyone rip you off. So that was uh, Muhammad Ahmed. Oh my gosh, now I need to walk about five miles this way because the ocean is this way. So let's go look at the Mediterranean coast over here.